Hey Nimplex and welcome back. This is Ash from Human PC99. This is going to be a very quick crash tutorial. Hopefully you've come here by clicking my other vid, which is the laptop not booting up. Hard reset tutorial. If not, welcome anyway. Now disclaimer first. Uh, there's absolutely no risk involved in doing this. Except you may electrocute yourself or kill yourself or your family or your neighbors. In the worst case scenario, you may actually end the entire universe as it exists. But hey, I always say, if you learn something from it, then it's well worth it. So, you've been warned. However, if you want none of the aforementioned phenomena, then consult a professional or do at your own risk. How to test a laptop charger or adapter using a digital multimeter. Get yourself a digital multimeter with auto ranging function, link below for one similar to this one. It costs around £20-ish. This one is the Mastec MS8268. The laptop charger has two parts. The mains plug, which plugs from the main socket, and two pin, and the adapter part, with the end plug going into your laptop. Today we're going to check the adapter part only. Check the voltage on the adapter. If you can see, it says 19 volt. But yours may differ. It means it takes 240 volt from the mains socket as AC, alternating current, and converts it to a more sensible DC, which is direct current of 19 volt into your laptop. Now, to test the adapter, make sure it's plugged in and switched on and plug your two pin. Some adapters have three pins. Make sure that your leads are plugged into the right place. So the black goes into the COM port and the red goes into the other one with all these symbols. Consult your manual if you're in doubt. Black is negative and red is positive. Make sure your charger is plugged into the main socket and turn on. Switch on your multimeter and turn the tab to the DC signal. That's this one, the V, and it says DC up here. Hope you can see that. The other one, the V with the squiggly line, that's for AC. You don't want that. You want the DC. Grab your adapter pin. And insert the red positive conductor inside making sure it touches the tip and uh, grab your black negative and place on the tip of the outside of the edge and as you can see on the multimeter we have a reading of 19.24 volts which is perfect just within the margin of error and that's how you do it once again guys you know the drill sub like dislike comment and share until next time peace out